Hey everybody, welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm gonna make a really simple Turkish cucumber and yogurt soup. This is a fast, easy blender soup. It takes about five minutes to make, a couple hours to chill in the refrigerator. If your ingredients are cold, you can pretty much go and serve it right away, although it's ideal if it's icy cold. The key to this whole thing is understanding that the technique I'm teaching you is basically how to blend a salad. The more you know, the more you know. And when it comes to food, the more you know about it, it becomes a backbone of information and knowledge that I have called culinary literacy. The more literate we are, the easier it is to cook, the more fun it is, the more we can share with our friends. These are European hydro cucumbers. We're just gonna split them. I'm gonna take one little piece and set it aside for garnish. I'm just gonna run this down the center of that cucumber. And by doing that, I remove the seeds. That cucumber seed is compost, fresh dill. You want your blender to be able to do its job. Put cut pieces of cucumber in. Don't do this in a food processor. It processes food, it doesn't blend it. I have dill, I have tarragon, I have some onion. I'm gonna add some parsley. I'm gonna add some ground white pepper. I'm gonna add some salt. I'm gonna add some olive oil. I'm gonna add some thick, Greek yogurt, and I'm gonna add some lemon juice. Now I always squeeze my lemon juice into a bowl. I don't wanna have seeds in my soup. There goes our lemon. And we're just gonna add a little bit of garlic. Now, you just want a little piece. A little goes a long way. We'll let that sit right there. Let's take a couple of pieces of cucumber, cut them into long strips. And I want these to be really, really tight because I'm gonna make a nice brunoise. That's a fancy French term for a micro dice. You know, I've got this shallot here and I'm just gonna finely mince some shallot. Now refrigerate this soup for four or five hours. I've also served this as a sauce underneath cold poached salmon, a little bit of onion, a little bit of shallot for garnish, a little bit of cucumber, a little bit of salt, drizzle a little olive oil across the top, a couple pieces of parsley just because we can. That's really good. Simple, refreshing, perfect spring or summer soup and a great technique, absolutely perfect. <laughs>